this is Nick and we're at the sandbox today as you can see the sands a little frozen still should be able to find some cool stuff though it's a pretty morning let's have some fun thanks for stopping by I really appreciate it Well, we're definitely having some fun out here so far. Finding some pretty cool stuff. I'm excited for. A couple different conglomerates, fossils, and some chert here. Thought that was pretty cool. Not sure what the black material is, but Definitely some quartzite in there. That's really cool. Kind of like a pudding stone. Here is a pudding stone. Only a couple pieces though. Jasper and shirt in there. And a quartzite matrix. That's pretty cool though. This really cool piece of Favorite here. You can see that honeycomb pattern in that. Nice sidewall structure. But that view is pretty. Here's some syringopora, pipe organ coral. That's a really pretty piece. I like this one a lot. Got some good detail. Little piece of Wotoski stone here. little hard to make out but it's definitely one that's pretty cool don't find too many of these here cool piece of unikite you can see that feldspar and epidote in that that one's a pretty color. I like that darker red in there. And then, really pretty piece of shirt. The inside of that's super waxy. I like that one a lot. Definitely see the frost on the ground, especially on the sand. It's a beautiful day so far. 30 degrees outside right now. It's not too bad. These next few finds I thought were pretty cool. This one I'm definitely excited for. That is a really cool piece of swimming up over there. That is awesome. 
the detail on that is beautiful. Super excited. That's amazing. Grateful to find that here. Also, some Cladopora. Don't find a lot of this here either. So that's exciting. I'm saying that a lot today. But that's pretty. Some great detail on that one. Here's a really cool death chip, death plate. Bunch of brachioprod shells in there. Fragments of them at least. A couple crinoid stems, tiny ones. But that's really pretty though. That's cool. Another pudding stone here. This one's got a little bit more than one or two pieces of jasper and shirt in it. A little smaller. But still, that's cool. I like that. Kind of the opposite of a pudding stone here. Probably was part of one at one point. But a piece of jasper with a little bit of quartzite going around the sides there. Probably broke out. Cool piece of banded shirt. I like that. A really pretty one. So are these last two. I really just can't help but grab anything that's waxy, bring it home. But I thought that had some pretty color to it, along with this one. Someone's wondering if that was a little pocket, but had some ice on it and it's all wet so it's hard to tell either way though that's still a really pretty color I like that a lot Last few finds of the day here. Super excited for. Definitely having some fun out here. Really cool pieces of chert. Like the color in these. All three of them here. That one kind of looked like it had some subtle banding to it. But really pretty colors. It's hard not to take that. Another pudding stone. Super excited for this one. Nice big piece of jasper there. Nice chunk of quartz inside of it also. Pudding stones have quartz, jasper, and chert inside of them. Inside of a quartzite matrix. So that's a pretty good one there. Excited for that. And last but definitely not least here. A death plate chip. But it's got a bunch of horn coral there. 
Also some syringopora. And also a gastropod at the end. How cool is that? It's the first one I think I found here at the sandbox. Usually find a couple of them on the railroad, not too many though. But that's super cool. So that one's awesome. I like that one a lot. Thank you, Sandbox. It was a beautiful day today. That's gonna do it for today's adventure. I really appreciate everyone stopping by. It means a lot. I hope everyone has a great rest of your day. And we'll see you again soon. Thank you. Goodbye.